Hello there, brothers and sisters, lovers, haters, boys, girls and vibrations. I hope everybody's well. Now, I'm not long through the door. I've been out for some food with DJ. DJ's upstairs at the minute watching that wise SML on YouTube. And I can't be in the same vicinity as it because it irritates the life out of us. It poisons my ears, right? So, come downstairs to knock a brew up and that. And I've just watched a little bit of Karma Corner. Because I like Karma Corner. You see, I unsubscribed from a lot of channels not long ago. But Karma Corner isn't one of them. You know, I find the man highly entertaining. And, um, you know, that entertainment yet hasn't run its course. You know, makes me laugh. And I like that. I was watching someone on there about Jack Draper's next fight. Now, while we're on Jack Draper, big shout out Jack Draper. You know, I've never met him a day in my life. But from what I've seen, you know, he seems like a very nice man. You know, a gentleman, an honourable man, a working man. Big shout out to the working man. The backbone of this nation. Now, and also from the people I've spoke to that know Jack, you know, they've said the same, said he's a very lovely lad. And um, seems to me like a good fighter, you know, and I've heard that as well. From what I've watched of him, you know, I knew him before he came about on here. I watched him a bit on the BKB and they can definitely fight. Now, his next fight, and by the way, I wouldn't begrudge Jack Draper making a penny, you know. And I hope he does well and I hope he makes a fortune, you know, in his life. I, I really do, you know, I've got no ill feelings or no, you know, no, no feelings of any negativity or anything towards the man you know i say a fair play to him you know and i hope he does well in all his endeavors and for what it's worth you know i haven't got a great deal of emotional investment in this fight but i know who i will be rooting for but karma corner went on to say something that i was watching you know said that there's going to be a two pound charge to watch this fight now I know I certainly won't be paying it. <clears throat> and I would never have a, a straightener, which is what it is really. You know, you call it BKB or whatever, but it's just a gym fight. You know, I'd never dream of asking anybody to pay for a gym fight. You know, and <clears throat> let's have it right. The last fight that Dean Lynch Warden that was in, you know, that was going to be billed as the latest and greatest and whatever. And they were trying to charge people a tenner for that. You know, ended up being streamed for free. You know, and the fight wasn't worth 20 pence. But, you know, you never know what you're going to get in a fight. That's for sure. You never, ever know what you're going to get in a bare knuckle fight because it's highly dangerous and a couple of shots can end it immediately. But, let's get on to this charging two quid for the fight. First of all, I think it's a bit of a disgrace, actually, you know, to, to string the YouTube community along for a while with all this back and forth. And then all of a sudden say, oh, and by the way, you know, I've dangled the carrot for this long, but it's actually going to cost you two quid to, to watch the fight. Now, and I know my last fight was pay-per-view, but listen, that, that card was the, the real deal, you know, and it's probably the best £5 anyone will ever spend as far as pay-per-view card and entertainment value goes. You know, it was quite the card for five quid, you know, but this isn't that. You know, no disrespect to Jack Draper because he's a fighter of a decent calibre, you know, and he can definitely fight, and I wish him well. But he's not the one asking for the money, is he? You know, and I just thought, the cheek of it. The cheek of it. You know, it's like... You see, when I was in active addiction, two quid was actually something to me. Even though I spent four tunes and four tunes on getting high... You know, sometimes I could only go to work with two quid in my pocket and that's all I had to feed myself on the day because all my other money went elsewhere. And I know that and I know that's nobody's problem. But what I'm saying is two quid is something to a lot of people, especially in the current climate. There isn't a lot of money kicking about. You know, and to ask for two quid for people to watch that fight, all I would say is wake up because... 
that fight will end up on YouTube, you know, and if it's not on the same day or within the hour, you can guarantee it'll be on, if not that night, the very next day. You know, that is for certain, you know. So all I would say to anybody is keep all of your money, get behind Jack Draper and uh, just smarten up a little bit. You know, you don't need to be paying money to watch a gym fight, you know, because... I'll bet everything I've got that that fight will end up on YouTube. So just bide your time and watch it for free. You know, why would you want to pay for something that you're going to get for free? But anyways, we'll close it on. Big shout out to Jack Draper. I hope he does the business. I'll be rooting for him. But, uh, you know, time will tell how that fight goes. All right, people. I'm going upstairs to watch a film with my little and get that SML off because it's irritating. All right. Bye-bye for now, people. Big love.